Hey there, everybody. Welcome back with the plat. Welcome to Pro Gamer Plays Professional Games Professionally. Challenge stones unlocked. Don't need them. I uh, I will bring the challenge myself. We're going to play some Wild Frost today. I've heard this game is kind of hard, which I must disagree. You know what I haven't done? I haven't played or seen anyone play the Shade Mancer, so we might try that out. Um, zero damage. Apply a demonize barrage. Aimless, I like. I mean, I like this kind of stuff, but it became... There There was some fights that I was doing where it was pretty darn brutal, Um, where there was, like, once teeth enter, you could just randomly kill yourself, like, on your main character, half, like, halfway through a run, just, like, in one turn. Shades, before the Wild Frost. Shades were elusive shadow creatures, must be the new faction uh, special thing. Okay, that that's lore. No offense to the lore. I'm sure it's fantastic. It is not of interest to me. I do like zero damage. I don't know what that sword's doing. All right, here we go. We got new stuff. Apply three frost. Deal an additional damage equal to tar blades. Blades. I can read in hand. The sunburst 2-2. Two, two. Is this not exactly the same? Oh, it does damage. All right, so this should do... Does it do two or three? It did three. So this one will do two. Um, We'll just have this guy take the hit for us. All right. You're going to attack? Are you, though? Be honest. I just wanted to... I, I hope I don't lose this first fight. I'll be so embarrassed. Um. Oh, my God. All right. We'll protect him. Okay. Oh, double damage all the way across the sky. Um, Those are both good, but I don't need them right now. I just want to kill. Summon a Junjun. A 3-2 Aimless. A Berry Bell. Um, How much HP do you have? You have 3 HP? Whew, that is low. We're still going to summon you, though. Oh, no boss yet. Okay, well, let's just slap this guy. Yeah, I'm okay just slapping that guy. We're going to give everyone some HP. Give me my money. Um, go and freeze this boy for now. We still got two more cards before uh, we get to the end. Might as well get three damage out of these. Pretty good at three damage. Summoned. Loses health after triggering and cannot be recalled. Okay, so they are they're temporary to protect us, basically. I think we're gonna let the this guy run away. I don't think there's a huge point to killing him. And then we'll smack this guy a couple times. Alright. Big Pang, welcome back to the party. Always good to see you. I think the game might be a little quiet, but also maybe not. Do we care? How much do we care about HP? I guess we do kind of care about HP. It keeps the summit around an extra turn, huh? And uh, this does not do an... Oh, this does do a damage, though. Oh. But it doesn't. We could use it on ourselves, or we could use it as an attack to, to get them. Okay, so we can manipulate the enemy's timer. We can make an enemy go sooner if we want. Um, let's go ahead and get Big Pang out of here. You're going to just die, but that's okay. This is what you're here for. Get double damage on these two guys. That's exactly what we wanted. Absolutely. We can summon another one. Seems pretty good overall. Sure. You kill him. You're going to just stay... How much are you hitting us for? One, two, three. Why is... why? I'm so dumb. You're going to only get hit for two. Just do this. Kill that guy. Alright, freeze this guy. 
I would say this game is hard to play well. I'll be honest. You're going down, buddy. What? The HP is actually pretty reasonable, I think. Oh, four damage. Wow, those are great. <laughs> they can be great anyway. Victory, first fight. That was a boss fight, right? That was a boss fight. Uh, only one more run. Charms is what we want. Uh, I don't want double frozen traveler, though. Bling snail cave is pretty good, too. The charm is great. Maybe we get... I, I just don't want... I don't think I want double companions this early. When an ally is hit, restore their HP by one. Okay. Um, I'll just take more pink berry juice. We need to get a uh, card that lets us summon a bigger boy, I think. When destroyed, summon Dreg. A four. Oh, that is eight HP itself. Wow, that's actually great, though, because it blocks for eight. And then when it dies, it actually comes back stronger. Trigger when an ally is sacrificed, killed by a team. Oh, my God. Groff, calm down. We're going to take the egg. The egg seems pretty good. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it just eats a spot, but... Just being an 8 HP shield feels good enough to me. Um, we want to kill this guy first. We do egg. You do hit everybody, which is kind of annoying. So we could hit you for 3. You're never going to attack. It's okay. To, and then I hope this kills you first. It does. Cool. Now we get a week in both of those. We get our juice back. We hit this guy for nothing. We're going to just summon our guy. Start getting the juice going. I don't want you around. I don't want you around. I guess we'll just uh, go ahead and get our juice up. I, I am trying to get this to break, though. All right. But I am also looking for a way to one-shot this guy. Let's give us a couple more blades. Where are the blades at? Yo, where are my blades at? Well, let's hit him for four. Ooh. He almost died there, but he's not. He's cool. Dreg. Oh, so it's like dragon egg, but it's just dreg. When hit, apply to a random enemy. Hey, that's not cool. All right, are we in trouble at all? I don't... Let's go ahead and throw this here. Start tanking. You are going to get hit for one, two, three. You'll instantly die if we don't kill this. Getting an HP on everything could be okay, but also what's okay is getting many damage. This will hit for quite a bit. Oh no, we're at negative four attack. What are we going to do? Good job, Dreg. Dreg is badass, bro. Dreg is the real MVP. This game is hard. Oh no, the... The egg is injured. Uh, that seems like a pure positive. We want to go to the shop, I think. Yeah, the shop is very powerful. Um, but we don't have that much money. Maybe we get money from this. We're at 143. I love this. Five damage to everything. We got no money. Too many cards, potentially, though. Doubles the target's overburn. Explodes when more than equal to health damaging all targets in the row. Well, summon leech on the enemy side. Gain a, um, whatever, a, a tooth when hit, when an ally is hit. Is he his own ally? 
These are both pretty good. This is AoE. I think we might want AoE. All right, so well, we want 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We want 1,300 total. We want to buy this and buy a crown, I think. Boost effects by one. Sure. What is and understand to me what that means? Mm. Probably good here, right? Probably increases hearts by two. I mean, that literally makes the card twice as good. Go ahead and buy the crown. Yep. But where do we want the crown? We get to play it before the round starts. Leech? Maybe Palm Bomb is where it's at. Because the Leech Mask, who knows how many times we're going to play it. You want something that you're going to play a bunch, probably. Well, not necessarily. This is just going straight up. Look at all the blood on this card. Get it out. Hmm. I do kind of like this, being able to play it in the beginning, but I guess if we were going to try to rely on this, we're going to want things like a companion. Yeah, but that doesn't really help them. All right, we're going to take Palm Bomb because it's just a safe bet for intro. Is the boss or a fight? This is the boss. But this is great because now we could, right? Boom, kill one of them, deal five damage to that. Then we put our guy down. There we go. They got a leech. I do think we want to get these down. Oh, he does hit for two. I didn't even notice that. Still, though. I welcome you to our party. Hit that guy for six. I mean, he's almost down. Um, You're frozen. I guess we just kill you. That way we don't worry about you. We are going to move forward here, I think. Even better, we'll just put the egg down. For some reason, I did not think you would attack. Let's tank up. You're going to die here, and then we're going to get two versions of you. Now I'm okay freezing you. Now we could deal four damage. You only hit for one. I'm not too concerned. I would like to use that a little more effectively. I think we smack you instead. Thank you for killing all your allies. All right. Um... You've got a we got a little while here. Maybe we just freeze you three turns. I think we have you block this hit first. Oh, badass, bro! The drag is where it's at. Let's just get you out of here, and then we smack you for. Oh, we could save that till next turn. You're going to hit him and kill him. We could. We could do it like this. Right. So you hit me for one. You hit me for two. And then you deal two to that. Um, so you're at six, five, four, four, five, six, seven. We'll just kill you next turn then. Oh, you're aimless, huh? Still, no one's attacking. You're dead. We are set. Oh, uh, this leech is badass. 
This guy's summons are great. I mean, that, maybe that's the whole idea. Rejaw the bell counter. I think that's probably pretty good. I think that's probably... Oh, no. The egg is injured. Almost like that's a positive. All right. Well, we want to get rid of some of our weaker cards. What's our bad card? Uh-oh. Maybe none. Are we actually... I actually kind of hate this. Which is crazy because it's my favorite card in the other deck. Go and grab that for me, buddy. The issue with the tar blade is if you remove one tar blade, every tar blade becomes way worse. But they are kind of bad. Am I crazy or did we only draw this one time? So yeah, we need to get rid of some cards. I don't really want a companion, but our companion limit's the same. When active, add three teeth to all allies. Okay. We don't have any overburn, so this is a mechanic that obviously we haven't interacted with yet. Applying frost all enemies. Um, I kind of like the going high HP, summon a bunch of dudes. We only have 47. Where's the money at, bro? We can't even buy anything. Ah. Summon Bebop. When destroyed, apply four to the attacker. Okay. Apply four, reduce by one when played. Apply three frost. The frost and the other one look too, a little too similar. Oh, we could buy the Numlin Biscuit. It was on sale. Hell yeah, let's go. Numlin Biscuit's a uh, card equal. When hit, reduce the attacker's attack by one. Well, this looks a little difficult. Let's go ahead and start with that, right? That card's so good. It's crazy how good that card is, and it still seems bad. Okay, we summon the egg. We summon this. We give everything HP. Now, we kill you. That doesn't do enough. Add a biscuit to this. You know. All right, you're dead. This does four, and you're you're dead. Now, oh my god, that's going to be rough to deal with. Let's move you up here. Move you up here. Move you right here. We are going to throw you away. Now we want the we're okay with the egg dying, right? Maybe we freeze you. These guys are going to kill themselves on the egg, which is wonderful news for us. We got the leech, we got this. Let's clog them up. Again, we are actually okay with them killing the egg. Don't freak out. The egg is a negative experience. We want... Now we want this guy to live. This is negative one attack. That's a uh, negative experience for us. Let's go ahead and... Oh, no. We're going to... This, this will kill our leech. We got to wait. I guess if we need money that bad, we got to do stuff like this, huh? You are going to hit us for three. Maybe we might even hit you for six. Let's, um... You're allowed to come up here. Do we do we hit you for six? We do. God damn these, the the we have a little nombo going here.
Uh oh. Okay. We've lost the run. Because I didn't read. When hit. That's just like that's so rough. Like one one bad card play. Oh man. One bad card play. I mean, we had that fight under control, but you gotta be so on it every single turn in this game, I feel like. I feel like one one turn and you're just over, man. Um, this is honestly better though. I actually think this is better than Snoof for what we were going for. We gotta go again. We got to go again. God, that that's so brutal. Uh, deal four additional damage to damage targets. That's pretty good. Restore three HP to all allies on a five. That's so slow. And you only have six HP. No, we, we like having eight HP. And I don't know if this does four damage. It doesn't say like this deals four damage, right? It, it just, to me, it implies that maybe anything will deal four damage if it's already been damaged. God, we're so fucking terrible. And dumb. So, yeah, we should we should prep. We're gonna get our stuff out. It's okay. Take two damage. It is aimless, so that's good. So let's take a look. I guess we're not gonna find out because we're gonna do this. We need the money. For sure. Like, actually, a lot. Because the money is really good. Okay, so I did three. So, let's take a look. Does this do two? It does. So, only you do the more damage. That's a little... That's a little brutal. We should kill you then, that way you kill this guy. I mean, it is a lot of damage still, like, don't get me wrong. Hello, Snow Knight. Um, we get, we'll just keep you frozen forever, honestly. I think we're fine here. I'll move you up here, and we'll even summon you uh, right here. And you will be, get healed before you get a chance to go. You're never going to unfreeze. Don't worry about it. It ain't a thing. We'll just kill you. Boom. Tar Blades. Tar Blades are a very obnoxious card. Because when you have four of them, it is insane. But then you also have four bad cards in your hand, kind of, right? It's like uh, sometimes it's so good. Other times it's so bad. Oh, this is so rough. A Bling Snail Cave is what we really, really want. But then we have to get two companions. I mean, we're taking it. I think the Blink Snail Cave is too good. Money is super powerful in this, it feels like. When deployed, copy the effect of a random ally. Mm. Is Snoffle good enough? Snoffle is way less good when we have to deal a damage to him for him to get his effect. This card is good, but I like I don't know what we use it with. Maybe we pick it up in a hope that it do something good with it later. It has four counter, so you want something with like a six counter that this is gonna copy. Um, what is? Can I take a look at my deck? Like, maybe it is just good with this, but it's gonna be random. I think Snuffle's better. It does do four damage still. Let's just get it in case it is, ends up being nuts. Let's see what we can get here to copy with it. All right. Well, this is the only one that does anything, really. We already have an, another version of the, the dog. These are both pretty scary. Poison is an easy way to... You know what? Oh, what? It does not have to be an ally. We're going to kill you.
we gotta freeze you. We don't care about this doing the poison because this guy already kills himself and you're already dead. So we're gonna just give you some HP here. Both these things are dead. Wow, all this poison stuff. This is the first time at least. Apply two poison, trigger against the target when an ally attacks. Whenever anything takes damage from poison, it gains stuff. Maybe we just kill this right here right now then. Obviously, Tarblade is not what we want to use here. Getting allies down feels bad, but it's always, like, super important. So this will cause them to apply some overburn, but it's not very good because you're not going to get up to six overburn, right? It'll be one, two. Actually, you'll apply two overburn, right? And then, ah, never mind. I, I did do the math wrong. Um, Overburn explodes on more than or equal to health, damaging all targets in the row. So it's not going to do anything. We are going to just allow you to kill this then. You, we can allow you to basically kill this guy. Or we can get eight more gold. And we got 147. Let's go ahead and make this thing be the one that dies you're only doing three this is okay apply one aimless three times though Trigger against the target when an ally attacks. Like, we have to kill you. That's so rough. You are going to apply three overburn. We don't want you to apply three poison. Do we want to increase the HP? Do we want to just freeze this guy? Maybe we just freeze this guy. Four, five, six, seven. Not quite enough damage. Um, we are going to allow you to apply three poison, but I think I want you to apply it back here. Do I want you to apply three poison here? Guaranteed kills this guy. But no one dies this turn, so we're almost going to kill you. you you're going to hit me three times, which is brutal. Let's go back here for a turn. Unfortunately, you're going to die regardless. All right, are, are we really bad at this game? Yes, we are. I've got to kill you. I don't think I have a choice. Okay. This guy is going to go down right here. And then you're going to blow up that guy. And then I am going to have to draw something to keep me alive next turn. These are both functional. They both stall for the exact same amount of time. But that keeps her three turns away from doing anything, right? So you are you are dead. Spank him. That four extra damage to 
damage targets is actually huge. I I really underestimated how much damage it is. Oh yeah, you're all injured. Of a random enemy. Ah. This case, this kind of sucks. The injuries are a brutal mechanic. That was a battle. That wasn't the boss. Oh my god. This game. This is perfect. This is exactly what you want to see. I think we'll be fine because this path. Well, it depends what we get here. Gain three fury. What is fury? Deal additional damage while alone in a row. Sure. Like, I, I think it has to be on a companion. I wouldn't call that good. But I'd call it reasonable. Now, this is good. Look at this money. We're at 200. Let's go. Now, we're going to buy... Wow, that's pretty good. Kill an ally, apply three frost to all enemies in a row. Let's see what we get here first. We might not use these right away. Let's just take a look. When destroyed, deal eight damage to the enemies in the row. Let's take a look. Can we put that on the mask? We can't. That is interesting, though. This is pretty good, but these... I think the charms are actually, like, 90% of where the power comes from. Numlin, this is exactly what we want. We want the crown, so we could always do this for free at the start of our run. Is this guy worth it? Is the splinter worth it? This guy, Shen, might be worth it. I kind of want something that wants to die. That way we could combine it with the with this. But none of our stuff wants to die. This is tough. The crown is so powerful. But eventually we want everything to have a crown, right? It's. I guess just getting Shen down always on the first turn is reasonable. But we got to keep Shen alive so they get their HP back. Meanwhile... Jun Jun might just be better. Are we buying a card? Always start with reducing things attacks every turn. I think that's that's good. Maybe we do this. Always have that. Gives us more development time. Yeah, I just I think it's better. I think we maybe we also give this to the uh splinter here. So we're just gonna you're gonna be played to be killed. And then we want something this is doesn't consume our turn when we use it. We want something we're always gonna use. The berry bell, June June, we probably use the most. This is probably our best card. I think the frost bell has potential. But I think we want to do the mask pretty much every time it comes up. It's just very powerful. We have no more money. What happened? Wait. You tricked me. I don't want to be here. Boss. All right. Well, at least we got more powerful. Okay. And this boss shouldn't be too hard. I actually thought that last fight was harder. We're okay with you getting hit. Give me your best shot. Hit all enemies. And explode eight. You are going to go first. And you are going to hit all enemies for two. That's pretty good. Let's go ahead and give... We're going to put this there. I Actually, we're going to move you up here. And we're going to give all these guys juice. And I think we boost you... We deal you one point of damage, you attack all enemies, then you explode for eight, killing both of those things, right? Oh, no, you don't explode till you actually die. That's right. The only... That makes more sense. Okay. Let's get you out of here. Okay. 
Everything's under control. Everyone calm down. Everything's under control. You're going to hit everything for three. I actually forgot about you. Please don't do that. I don't know if we could prevent that. How much damage do I take here? I take a lot. We have to move you. Because you hit everything. Then we're the only thing alive. And then you hit us for five. You hit us for so much. Or you just die. Or you just die. Before you get it. Because he hits. That explodes and kills it all. All right. I know how things work. Thank you. Um, I guess we start smacking, huh? That way this does eight da damage. Oh, baby, that's super strong. We only have to do three to kill you, so we're just going to do that. I know that makes you mad. But we also have this... You have two turns, and we kind of have three turns. This is pretty darn good, right? That applies... F that's basically doing four damage. And then once we get you down to seven... Oh my god, this asshole. He hits for 12, though. You're going to kill both of my guys. Even if we bring it down to four with this. You would kill everything. I can keep... If I come here, I move you here. I could do this, and we don't instantly lose. And now we've won. I really wanted to keep that guy alive, but we can go ahead and hit this guy. Now we got all the time in the world. We only have to do three damage. Wow, okay. This game's fucking hard, bro. Companion limit plus one. We got summons. We're fine. I know you're still injured, bro. I would thank you for recovering. Okay, the munch, even though we can't do anything at the woolly snail that I'm interested in, I think a free charm. This is a free 50 money, essentially. Plus. Replace strength and apply overburn. That's got to be good. Never mind. It can't be used on these. So we could use it on like this guy. It's just, th this is good, but we got to hold on to it. We got to find something that actually does something interesting. So unfortunately, we have to get rid of a tar blade. And I actually think the Sumber, the, I actually, it's crazy how much the Muncher hurts to use as this character. Summon a copy of an enemy on your side with one HP. Restore two HP in a barrage. The leech is great. We could just buy another charm though. Is the leech better? AoE. I think we've got reasonable AoE. It does also take a slot. I think the leech might be like insanely good. When consumed, add plus two to all allies. Well, I'm not going to say that that added a huge amount of our power level to our run, but... It's just the battle. We're fine. Well, we're going to toss you down here. Keep everyone safe. We're going to toss you down. Just get all the damage going. I do like the Explode 8. This guy is fantastic. Um, we 
We're just going to put you there, actually. We're going to have all you guys do this. Just get more HP. We do need to deal a couple damage here to this guy. Never mind. That guy, I forgot that that... I know that guy applied to everyone. I didn't actually know that he would uh, deal the damage, though. He's going to do 8, 9, 10 damage. He's dealing it to a June June right now. We don't care at all about that, honestly. This is good, though. Because now, this guy will get hit for two. And it'll do two damage to all this stuff. Which isn't even that good, if I'm being honest. But we got time. Let's go ahead and just stun you. So this guy dies and explodes everything, right? Oh, no, no, no. It doesn't do it straight to his HP. All right. For some reason, I thought it would just go straight to his HP. We got four turns to kill each of these. But I, I want to um, mostly redraw just to get a good defense. Like this right here, right? Now I don't have to worry about at least one of them. Um, so every time he hits, he does explode and hit them all. Like, that's, like, very, very strong. Um, you are going to hit this guy for four. Correction, you're going to hit that guy for four. Welcome to the party. You're going to come over here. We're just going to juice up. Eh, let's juice up this guy. You're going to kill that. You're going to kill this and heal everybody. This guy is the one that needs it. Right, we'll try to kill this guy this turn. There's a lot to keep track of every single turn. When hit, gain juice. Okay. Got another one of these. Just throw it down. It's always fantastic. We can make you do zero damage. You do give everyone juice, which is very bad. We definitely want you to not do that. I feel like you can move allies around however you want, right? You're going to do three and do AoE three. So I think we just hit this guy first. That'll kill you, you. That'll bring this guy up to the front. Eh. Let's just freeze this guy a bunch. We don't we don't want to have to deal with him. He's going to hit way too hard. <laughs> oh, why is this so difficult to deal with? Um, You're going to hit for two. No, you're going to instantly die. So if we hit you, because you get hit for a lot, then you're going to hit him for two. You're going to hit him for two. So he's getting hit for four right now. Okay, I got to just get the damage out. I guess we just are going to kill this guy. I know we can recall our companions, but I need, <laughs> I need him. He does so much damage. These things are fucking brutal. Okay, what am I going to do here? I am going to... I know the Fury was a, a terrible thing, but we didn't, we didn't choose it. Maybe I do bring him back. No, it, it's five AoE. It's too good. We could heal him during a, a fight. I could do this. 
then have him do six AOE at the bottom. This will do six AOE. Won't solve our problems, but it'll make them heck of a lot better. Okay, you're hitting for... You only hit for five right now, actually. That's not too bad. I mean, it's not good. I think we should avoid it. Mm. We're going to take the five. Okay. This is this card is so good. Holy crap, that card is so good. Keep up the good work. We're going to save this for a second. What is this? Uh, 8, 9, 10. That is 6. All right. Well, this won't quite kill him, but it'll almost kill him. I think we just do the... We, we're going to do this. You only do two damage. You do zero damage, actually. Boom! This is great. This guy is fucking... Shen is badass, bro. Keep it up, Shen. You're a goddamn general here. You're hitting for eight? Do I block it? Yes. I guess that counted as him being hit, which I didn't think about. He has a different icon when he got blown up. We're still at one. We're fine. This game's fucking hard, bro. <laughs> I don't know, just smack him, I guess. Oh my god. This is phase two? That's just a battle, right? That's not even a boss. Like, these fucking battles, bro. But we did get our injuries injuries back. Thank you. Um, We can get rid of the rest of these tar blades. We would need a... I think we'd need some stronger cards, though. Either way, we get the treasure. Let's see what we get from the treasure before we make our decision here. An 8-2 barrage hits all targets. A f hits a random uh, target in the row. So it does one damage four times randomly. That doesn't seem that good. I mean, maybe if you upgrade it. Um, summon a copy of an ally. That seems good. One, we need a consume card to use this uh, strawberry. And now plus two HP to all allies. I think we go for the charm. If we get another one of those Nublin things, it's so good. Tarblade is gonna look so fucking bad. The bell bear the berry bell might not be that good. Call me crazy, but I don't know what I'm doing, alright? I don't know how to build a deck. I just like to make them smaller and smaller until I'm like, where's all my cards? Add one scrap. Oh, scrap is really good. That, um, well, never mind. Not in this case. Because we can't get this off, it's just not that good yet. Jeez. I didn't feel like I got that much stronger here. Oh, great.
adds aimless to all enemies, huh? You also hit for uh, fucking five. You're at 14 HP. What is your problem? Here's what we're going to do. I want to know if... um. I want to know how this works. You do take the bite. Oh my god. We're going to get fucked. We got to kill that thing. This is a brutal combination. Holy crap. This thing is... We do have our friend here. Guess you always do this first, huh? Are we alive? We are alive somehow. Um, so we all have the three things now. Thank you for taking that. I didn't even think about that. So you're going to hit for five to this guy. I'm kind of in the who cares camp maybe we bring this guy up oh did i do math wrong why is this why did he die fucking a this morrow man jesus how do i kill it with with tar blades i mean i was i'm going for like a minion focus build here but this guy just absolutely is Reckon me. I mean, we got to get this down. We're going to need the HP, or otherwise, we're going to die, right? Okay, that worked out very well. I know, I know math. This is actually pretty good here, right? Did we make it through this? I won't say we've made it through yet. You only hit for one. Can we bring you over here? You hit for... You, you'll kill this, and you'll deal three damage to that. Let's just freeze that. It doesn't blow up when you just kill it. Okay. We didn't hit it, though. Maybe it starts with two. Give everyone some HP. God knows we need it. This thing is... going to ruin me. Okay, this will do one to us. We'll go down to ten. And then he's going to hit us for four. Because we're going to do four, eight to him. Trigger when hit. Holy shit, bro. Holy crap. All right, well, let's stun him for three turns, I suppose. Five. How do we kill this thing? I don't want you to hit me for one. You're going to tank a hit for me. You can't tank many hits, but you're going to tank this hit for me. I wonder if we attack him. If how this works right now.
I guess we could just smack them like this, but we don't have the items really to do this, I feel like. How do we do seven damage to you? We need you to do it. You do four, eight. No, you do four, five. That's six. And then I guess that guy will have to kill him. But then we're each going to take... You're taking six damage from that, right? Yeah. Because that's going to give him four. This is going to give him up to six. And then you're going to take six. He goes up to eight, but he dies. Jesus. All right, let's see if he activates. Didn't seem like, I mean, this it didn't seem like he did anything, right? I do want to use this, so I think I just use it. He didn't. Okay, the snow is preventing him from triggering. So this guy is actually not that bad. Just keep him keep him doing that then. Chen's hit him every time. Keep it up. I mean, we're getting through there. Thank God this thing doesn't have, like, some sort of frost resistance, right? This blizzard bottle is literally saving our life right now. I'm going to just keep increasing our HP. Mm, yeah, we're going to trigger this. Woo! <laughs> All right. Injury is good. Splinter, you deserve to be injured. Give me this. Give me this. Boss. Boss. This is a long video, but you know what? We lost 20 minutes in. See what we get. We need to buy a crown for sure. Cannot be recalled, but plus 7 HP. Okay. There you go, Shen. Enjoy the... Oh my god, Shen is such a... Gangsta. We're going to equip this on who? Mm, maybe having double Shen in the intro is really good. I think so. I don't even know if this is good. I'm not sure if I want to use that yet. We're going to buy another one of these, or do we want to buy this? Take 100 damage when another soul card is destroyed. Soul bound card is destroyed. A random ally that could just straight up kill you. They could, I assume, unless they could can't target your hero. When destroyed, apply four to the attacker. Mm. All right, give me something good. I don't like how RNG these are. Restore two HP on a kill. I mean, sure. To who? To yourself. All right, we'll take it, I guess. I mean, having a little bit of healing there is fine. We will give you this. I don't know if this is good, but whatever. You got a charm. Did we get more powerful? I think so. We got a really good Shen. That was that was our big upgrade there, I would say. Crunker. He's only got 8 HP. But you have to hit him eight times. I was like, wait a second. Why does he only have eight? He has more than eight. So this is actually going to be pretty bad here. Hmm. These are pretty... Okay, this is probably good. Do we want to just do this? Or do we want to hit eight 
I don't know if we could hit. So we got three turns on. We could freeze him. We're going to plop you down. I kind of, because I want this guy to die. You're going to hit six, six. Oh, it's actually only these two. Okay, we're not we're not too concerned about that then. Well, in fact, we might even just um smack you. One damage is equal to... uh Because this guy uses scrap. Uh, it, uh, all forms of damage always are one. Yeah, I'll throw you down. You hit us for two when we hit you. I'm going to apply a bunch of blizzard to you. Oh, the that always explodes. Oh, well, that's insane. I didn't even think about that because he doesn't have max HP. Let's go ahead and drop you. We want the the healing. You're going to hit three damage up front. Good. Oh, you are going to hit for four here, though. That was probably a mistake on my part. We got three turns. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and lower all their attacks. Would love if that also froze them like it did in a previous round that I had. If Smackback hit the front, does it activate? Counterattack after being hit. You're only hitting for one. This is fine. And you kill the wall. Boink. And you healed yourself. That's right. I don't want to hit the redraw bell. You don't even know what you're talking about. All right, if we just get their attack low enough, we don't care, right? Five, six, seven, eight. Let's get the HP. This guy having HP is messing me up. While well, active, all all allies and minus three to all enemies. That's pretty rough. I could do this, right? Puts me up to one. I could do five, which should be enough. I even heal. You're in for six? What's your problem? No, you're not. Don't lie to me. We'll freeze you for three more turns. This seems too good. I forgot this always takes one damage. You're going to smack back pretty hard. Okay, it does less damage. We can make him just do one damage to everything. We're going to switch this for a second. Make him do one damage to everything. And then you're going to hit pretty hard. We want you up. He's going to summon a bunch of stuff. Um... 
Here's what we're going to do. Healing all allies three is probably pretty good here. Okay. You're dealing... Oh, my God. We are scaling, bro. Die. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get out of here, scrub. All right, you only hit it. You hit everything for one. Go ahead. Enjoy. Oh, you the spiked wall attacked his own ally. I mean, that makes sense. Like, cards do exactly what the cards say, but you don't always think it would interact in that way, right? Boom, nine to his dome. Oh, watch out for this. Don't, it's so easy to accidentally forget one thing. It's so easy to accidentally forget one thing. We're going to make him do one to everything. He's his own worst enemy, man. Oh, bro, say goodnight. Oh, man. This is the thing. It's the really fun, good combat. Interesting, good, fun combat. But sometimes it's uh, one one missed card play really quick. And it's like, oh, no, I don't want to do it like that. And then you're just out of luck. Like, I could have lost at any point just by you, you can never take a break, I feel like. We don't like that guy. I understand. We don't like that guy. We're going to freeze him. I guess that's for three turns. It's not as good, huh? We're going to drop you. I'm not too concerned right now. I should be paying attention because these guys start. Obviously, this guy goes crazy. Like, I don't even want to hit him, right? He's Now he's going to hit me for 10. That Which would just kill me. This is why it's like, oh, it doesn't even, it's not even clear to me necessarily. Like, like oh, this is lethal. He'll hit you back and then you'll F and die. We got to freeze them before we do that kind of stuff. Oh, these guys also are getting their wild, of course. No! Oh! What did I say? Accidental lethal. Because this guy killed the guy up front, there was no other target. I automatically targeted that thing. Oh, my God. It's so, it's so brutal. It's so brutal. You got to be on. You can't make any assumptions, man. It's a fun game, but I really wish there was like an undo that turn. Like, oh, I didn't think that part through. Can I replay that turn? Um, it, it's so easy to make a mistake in this kind of game. Um, in this game specifically is exceptionally bad. At least like in um, Slay the Spire, you can escape, load back into the game, redo the fight, right? Um, but still, really, really good. I'm frustrated I lost. We did get the robots. These guys must be the ones that make all the wooden things. We'll have to try that out next time. Anyway, I did have fun. Long as crap video, but doesn't matter. Had a good time. Much love. Perplatypus is perplatypus. We'll get a win one day. We'll get a win. Until then, though. See you guys next time.